Hey Summit, we just want to give you guys a quick end of year update for 2020. So in March, COVID caused the borders to close down in Guatemala, the Dominican Republic, and Nicaragua. Many of our groups were not able to travel to Mexico because of local restrictions. The spring break season and summer are typically the busiest times of year for our ministry. So the pandemic hit our ministry hard, but God still was at work. Um, our leadership came up with a campaign called Hope Restored. Many of our groups that were not able to come on trips were able to give their funds to still have the homes built by staff and local volunteers. In 2020, we were able to build 187 homes. 82 of those were through the Hope Restored program and we raised over $717,000 through Hope Restored. In September, David and I got to help build the ministry's 6,000th house since it began in 1993. This happened to fall when we already had an all staff build planned. Um, and it was also really special because this home was funded by the Hope Restored program as well. This home was built for Jaime and his wife, Maria. And Maria shared with us that her and her husband had actually been struggling in their marriage, but she saw that this new home was a sign from the Lord that they needed to keep fighting and keep working on their marriage um, and to continue to work for their relationship. The sponsoring pastor also shared that he hopes that this home will be a reminder to their two daughters as well, Hasmeen and America, that God loves them and will always take care of them. Another highlight in 2020 for Dave and I was that we actually were able to pay off the remainder of our debt. Um, and this was super exciting for us. This was a major goal that we wanted to accomplish. Um, and we just want to say, first of all, that all glory and praise goes to God. Um, it's only because of Him that we were able to do something like this. Um, we also just want to say thank you so much to all of our generous supporters who continue to give and continue to pray for us. Um, we just appreciate you so much. There's no way that we would have been able to accomplish something like this without your help. In August, my family was able to come help build one of the homes through the Hope Restore program. My mom, all four of my sisters, and my brother-in-law were all able to come. The family we built for was a large family of 13, all living in one house. So we were able to give them more room to spread out. And this was also a chance for our group and the sponsoring pastor to share the love of Christ and share the gospel with his family. They're still not believers, so we just ask you guys to pray for them uh, that they would come to know the love of Christ. We just want to say thanks again to all of you guys for praying for and supporting us through 2020. We ask that you guys just please continue to be in prayer for the ministry of Casas Por Cristo. We're excited to see the way that God continues to work through 2021.